Um, you mentioned the regularity of which I'm publishing and I always come back to something that I believe I listen to Seth Godin's podcast akimbo, which is definitely a great podcast. Yep. He covers a lot of interesting territory in that, in that show. And one of the things that he goes on about on occasion is this difference between being authentic and being a professional. Hmm. And the illustration that he gives is, do you want your surgeon? If you're going to about to go and have open heart surgery and your surgeons had a bad day at home and they don't really feel like operating. Do you want them in your consultation just before you go under the knife for them to disclose that to you and to be authentic with you about how they're feeling in that moment? Or do you want them to be a professional? Do you want them to show up and regardless of what's going on at home, put that in a box for now and focus on you and give you the best open heart surgery that they possibly can? And I think we'd all, we can all safely say that it's the latter, right? We want yeah. the surgeon to be a professional. And so I kind of internalized that with the podcast and have really taken that on to mean that regardless of what's going on for me in my life and projects and other things and whether or not I feel like preparing for a podcast and recording a podcast and reviewing an edit of a podcast, I just do it. It's become a practice. And it would be very easy for me to opt out of that and go, I'm just going to skip a week. But I think if you look at any one, you know, such as yourself or uh, any author or any podcaster that's that's having an impact and is is putting out this content on a regular basis, there's a reason for that. It's that they've decided that it's time to be a professional and that this is something that they take seriously. And while it might be a hobby as it, as in it doesn't generate an income, it doesn't mean that you can't be a professional in your approach to it. So I've I've um you know, I've adopted that approach and really took on board what Seth Godin was saying there about the difference between a professional and uh, being authentic. Hmm. Have you ever considered to take a break or skip one or two weeks? Oh, every every almost every month. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe every week. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 